I wonder if this Tesla is gonna smash. Oh, it's brand new. Getting that little nervous feeling because I got my I got my lights just blowing up. Man, we are mobbing. We are on the Suron, of course. You can already tell by the noise. And uh, we haven't done our maintenance yet, so our chain is still slapping around everywhere on this bike. We got another day of work, of course. I dread work, guys. I dread it. And hey, you know, it pays the bills. Can't complain too much. I had fun in my last video going off road with the Super 73. I almost took it today and then I forgot to charge it. And this one was already charged. I don't like to keep my, my bikes like fully charged sitting there for a while, so. Definitely wanted to uh, drain the battery on this thing. And hopefully in tomorrow's video, hopefully if anything goes right, uh, me and my girl are supposed to go riding. I hope everything goes right. But yeah, I'll get her on uh, like the Aerial Rider or the Super 73, probably the RX. I'll probably get her on the RX because she likes that thing. And uh, I'll probably get on the Aerial Rider just because a lot of you guys have been watching a lot of the Aerial Rider videos. And you guys are really uh, interested in them because everyone's been waiting for the bikes. I did see that they're shipping out now. Some of them are. That's pretty cool. So you guys will have them in no time. And I have a guy, I believe his name's Tony. I'm sorry if I'm getting that wrong, but I believe it's Tony. Thank you for watching the channel. He's 70 years old. He hit me up about wanting to buy my uh, aerial rider off of me because uh, he saw that I was talked about not having it for a very long time. And I will probably sell it next month sometime because I like to kind of get bikes and switch them out and ride different stuff and uh, it's crazy to know that my viewers i have you know people that are in their 70s watching my videos and i know for sure i have people that are like 17 18 watching my videos too because i've seen the the stats and stuff but my average views that i get from people the age is i think 34 to 44. that's what uh, youtube's telling me so it's kind of cool I'm kind of reckless and stuff like I know I'm very informational I, I you know I say it how it is I talk about a lot of stuff everyone else doesn't talk about so I know why a lot of you guys follow my channel because we go over a lot more stuff than what other people would say I'm not biased to anybody I'll point out the bad stuff I'll talk about the good stuff you know it's just how it comes let's go it's hot guys I'm not gonna lie it's like burning up hot right now It is so hot that like I can feel it like all my legs and my pants like it's burning up. gonna take a while to turn isn't you aren't you yes please tell me going that way man recently I've been getting invited to those group rides and stuff but man I just can't make them I think there's like one that was in Sacramento I think I got invited to one in Long Beach somewhere out there and uh, I just can't make them guys like I work 40 hours a week just two weeks ago I worked 48 hours it's just been real rough and uh, me trying to get time off like that is I have to request it so I need like uh, 
a two and a half week in, uh, advance timing to know like I need to take this day off. I'm gonna try to adjust the compression and see if that fixes anything. Just feels like real uh, bumpy in the front. That's the thing. Dang it. I should pass them pedaling. Let's let's do that. Let's pedal. Yeah. yeah. I go through the front. Yeah, we tried. I like going that way though. All right, guys, let's switch to nighttime. All right, so um, you might be able to tell by the headlight a little bit, but it is sprinkling. Not much. I'm a little worried. Not for wrecking or anything like that, but I'm more worried about the go, not the GoPro, the bike. Definitely worried about the bike and all the electronics and stuff like that, but it's really not bad at all. Like there's really nothing. It's like a mist right now. All right, I'm going because I don't like this light and I want to get this. Uh... Oh, it didn't even turn green. I was trying to make it. I wonder if this Tesla is going to smash. Try to keep up with it. Oh, it's brand new. Dual motor, Model Y. Hey, we ain't doing too bad. I should pull up next to him pedaling, that'd be funny. He was smashing though. No, we weren't doing like terrible. I mean, yeah, we weren't gonna win whatsoever, but I mean, we weren't doing bad. The cool thing is it'd be a super silent race. got the motor up to 47 C but uh don't get me wrong it is gonna go up a lot more you like the you like the rainbow ground effects we got today pretty sick we got them blasting we are smashing home remember the videos I used to do rushing home to work <laughs> Those were some uh, good videos. Ruben saw on his uh, live stream, I remember posting up and saying, this guy's rushing home to work. And then it just shows me speeding everywhere. Yeah, it's hilarious. If you guys want to know kind of why I'm really rushing home, I got a resume I need to get completed and done. Um, I'm trying to put in for a higher position at my job. I've been there for about 16 years and uh, it's time to kind of move up and make a little bit more money. 
So I really need to get started on that because uh, the job bids, they don't stay up for very long. So I think I have to have it done by tomorrow night. So I'd rather get it done today. So that's pretty much, pretty much it. That's really why. Talking about the RGBs a little bit. I mean, they look dope as hell. I think I have eight of them on the bike right now. And um, I got my second kit that I ordered from Sir Ronster and the, I believe the, what is it? Sir Ron Shop. I, mean, I got my second kit, but I also found a link on eBay that sells them without the main connection. But all you do is need the LEDs. Once you have the main connection for the, the Suron bike, all you need is extra ones to plug in. So shit, if I wanted to, I could probably put 20 of them on this bike if I really wanted to. So I might uh, add some more to this bike. Just, I don't 100% know yet like what I want to do. Definitely don't want to do it anytime soon. We got our brake rotors and uh, we got to bleed the brakes, get all that done. I'll probably change out the, the pads too. I have extra ceramic ones sitting there. What the heck? Go. Are they afraid they were going to jump out or something? My mirror keeps moving. <laughs> I definitely think I'm going to put the plastic ones on these bikes and order for all my my e-bikes. The metal ones are great if your bike goes down, but at the same time, I'm like getting tired of not being able to see, so I'm always adjusting these. to back getting that little nervous feeling because I got my I got my light just blowing up I really truly think having an electric vehicle gives you that upper advantage where they they just don't look if they don't hear anything going on around them they just they just keep on their way but if you pull up in a loud ass car with a big old muffler it draws their attention because they hear the noise and then they instantly start looking to see where it's coming from and bam they see your leds like i have on this bike you're gonna get pulled over man that's cool we got away with that smash in a hole coming up way back there pretty fast but uh we're about to dip off into my neighborhood anyway and they're not even close but they definitely came out of nowhere so all that riding right there on 14,000 watts motors at 85c kind of a nice day i mean it's not cold but it's not like hot hot all right guys well, see, that car was coming. We go. See you guys in the next one. Take care out there. Be safe. Don't be crazy like me. Later, guys.